Hey everyone, today I am back doing another video and I'm filming this video in a new room. As you can see, I'm filming this video in my room at my mom's house. I don't think I've ever filmed a video in here before, um, except like my vlogs and I was vlogging. You've seen a little bit of this room. But yeah, I just decided to switch some things up and film in here uh, just for a little change and everything like that. So anyways, today's video is going to be my lipstick collection. I have been planning on filming this video for so long, but I never really got around to doing it until now. So I think I counted up to 18 lipsticks, which is kind of a lot, but there's definitely um, other people out there that have a bigger lipstick collection. But I still wanted to do this video because, I don't know, I just thought it would be kind of a cool video to do. And so since I have 18 lipsticks, I'm going to try and go quickly with this, just quickly showing you guys um, all my lipsticks, because I don't want this to be like a 30 minute video. Uh, just for your guys' sake. And I'm also going to be swatching these lipsticks on my actual lips, and I'm not going to be using a lip liner um, when doing the swatches, just so you guys can see like the true color of these lipsticks. Now that's probably going to drive me nuts because like I always use lip liners. Like if I'm applying lipsticks or lip glosses, like I love lip liners. I feel like they make the lip look look so much better when you have like a lip liner and everything like that. But just for the sake uh, of you guys seeing the true color and to kind of save me a little bit of time, uh, I'm not going to apply a lip liner even though that'll totally kill me inside. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. So if you want to see my lipstick collection, then just keep on watching. So the first lipstick I have is this one right here. This is one of Maybelline's um, nude lipsticks. I never like know the um, actual names of these. Uh, it's like part of the Maybelline's Color Sensational line, but these are the nude ones if that makes any sense. And this is in the shade 910 Bare All, if you can kind of see that at the bottom. And I can just show you. Sorry, there, <laughs> there's lipstick, uh, another lipstick on this, but that's just kind of what it looks like. It's like a super nude color. I usually don't wear this lipstick like totally on its own. Usually I'll put like a lip gloss, uh, maybe that's a little bit of a darker nude on top, just because this one is so nude, like it literally, looks like you're wearing concealer on your lips, basically, but it's still a gorgeous color. The lipstick that I have is this one right here. This is from Rimmel London, and this is uh, Kate's lipstick. Kate who, though? Is it Kate Moss? Uh, okay, it doesn't say, but it says Kate on there. I think it's Kate Moss, but I could be completely wrong, but it's from Rimmel London, and this lipstick is in the shade 113 and this is another nude shade so it just looks like this as you can see it's a little bit more of like an orangey nude I would say but again it is a gorgeous color and I feel like when you put it on your lips it is a lot lighter than um, it's looking on camera as I can see um, so usually I'll put like a darker nude lip gloss on top of this as well just because it is such a light nude I have is this one right here. This is another Maybelline Color Sensational Nude Lipstick and this is in the shade 935 Cinnamon and you guys have seen this um, lipstick before. As you can see I've almost used all of it. I love this lipstick. I'm sure I've used it before in like tutorials or get ready with me's or just wearing them in my videos in general. I just absolutely love this lipstick. It is a darker nude color but it really is just a gorgeous color and I absolutely love this lipstick. I have is this one right here. This is from BH Cosmetics. This is one of their Color Lock Long Lasting Lipsticks, I believe they're called. And this is in the shade Faithful. And it just looks like this. As you can see, again, it's like a darker nude. It's kind of like a pinky nude, I would say. But um, when you put it on your lips, I feel like it comes more off as a dark nude than a pink. But um, yeah, so that's just what that looks like. And I absolutely love this lipstick. And I love these lipsticks in general, like the Color Lock Long Lasting Lipsticks, because they are all matte lipsticks and they are just absolutely gorgeous. They're all so pigmented. I have other ones that I'm going to be showing you in this lipstick collection. And yeah, I just absolutely love these lipsticks. I 
have is this one right here. This is from Revlon, and this is a kind of like a nude pinky color, and this is in the shade 415 Pink in the Afternoon. So it just looks like that. Hopefully you can see that okay because this is almost gone, but it is like a, it's like a lighter nude. It's, uh, I don't really know how to describe this. It's like, it's, it's a pink, but like it's not, it's kind of like a nudie pink. I don't know how to describe this color. Yeah, that's just what that looks like. I absolutely love this lipstick because it is kind of like a pinky nude. I guess you could say like it's like a lighter pink and I really like those kind of pinks so yeah <laughs> sorry that was like a terrible explanation that I have is this one right here this is from Mac and this is a bright orange lipstick and this is in the color Morange so I will show that to you guys that's what it looks like. This is such a gorgeous lipstick and especially if you like orange lipsticks, I would definitely recommend this one. Like it's just, it's so pigmented and it's just a gorgeous color. is also an orange lipstick and it is from NYX. It is one of their Macaron Lippies. So I will just show you what that looks like. As you can see, I don't know if this one is as wearable. Um, kind of like with all the NYX Macaron Lippies, uh, I pretty much just got them just to have them like for my collection. But um, it's still fun to kind of play around with and you know wear if you are really like bold and everything like that. Oh and this is in the color Orange Blossom. I forgot to mention that. is another macaron lippies and i think the next few are going to be macaron lippies but anyways this is the next one that i have this is kind of like a light blue color and this is in the color earl gray so as you can see that that's just what it looks like i can't remember if it was this one or the next one i'm about to show you that i wore wore in a get ready with me i can just not talk sometimes um i think it might have been this one it was like a few months back, but I included this in a get ready with me that I did. And um, again, not as wearable, but um, these lipsticks are just perfect for any collection. Like if you just love makeup or lipsticks in general. I have is this one right here again NYX Macaron Lippy and this is in the color pistachio. This is kind of like in orange or not orange what am I talking about <laughs> like a blue green turquoise type color as you can see that that I have again another macaron lippy and this is one of their um, purple colors I believe in this um, macaron lippy collection they have two purple colors I think this is the lighter one if I'm not mistaken and this is in the color lavender and I absolutely love this lipstick. I actually have worn this lipstick out um, a couple times. I wouldn't say this is the best looks lipstick to wear, um, kind of with the other macaron lippies, just because they are such like a bright color that it really makes your teeth yellow. And especially me, because my teeth are already yellow because I be loving coffee and Diet Coke and all that stuff so it just makes my teeth look terrible but this really is a gorgeous color and I would say this is one of the most wearable ones especially if you like purple lipsticks I would definitely recommend this one not only for collection purposes but um to even wear out because I do think it is a really beautiful purple colored lipstick that I have is this one right here. This is another um, Maybelline Color Sensational Lipstick. Um, and these are the Vivid Lipsticks. Um, this one is part of the, like the Color Sensational Vivid line, if that makes any sense. And this is in the color 905 Brazenberry. And this is one of my favorite purple lipsticks. As you can see, this one is almost out as well. And it's just such a gorgeous purple color. Like, I know I've worn this before in my videos and things like that. I don't know if I ever did like a get ready with me 
Oh yeah, I might have done a get ready with me, but anyways, so yeah, that's just what this one looks like. A gorgeous, gorgeous purple color. If you're looking for a purple color lipstick, that is also cheap, but good quality. I would definitely recommend um, this one by Maybelline. that I have is another Beat Cosmetics Color Lock, Color Lock Long Lasting Lipstick. And this is in the color Loyal. And this is just a bright pink lipstick. As you can see, and it's super bright on the lips, but it's a really, really gorgeous color. So that's just what that looks like. And again, like I said, with these um, Color Lock lipsticks from BH Cosmetics, they're great quality. Um, they're matte lipsticks and they're super pigmented. Is this one right here this is another NYX macaron lippy and I believe yes this is my last um, macaron lippy lipstick that I have and this is in the color rose and it's just a nice pink color as you can see um, this is another one of the most wearable ones I would say from the NYX macaron lippy line I believe I might have wore this lipstick out once but again with the whole like making your teeth yellow just because it is such like a pow like a bright color is this one right here this is from Revlon I believe yes and it is in the color 440 cherries in the snow and it's just a nice red color as you can see it's a little bit of a darker red but it's not too dark like I would say I would say it's still like a true red not like a brownie red or anything like that <laughs> That I have is this one right here again another color lock long-lasting lipstick from BH Cosmetics and this one is a true red and the name is called true heart so that's what this lipstick is called and this is just what the lipstick looks like um, as you can see it is a true red and it shows like a true red on the lips as well and it's just a gorgeous color and I absolutely love wearing this lipstick Again, another long color lock long lasting lipstick from BH Cosmetics and this is in the color Blissful and this is kind of like I don't know how to describe this color I feel like it's coming off way darker than it is on camera but um anyways it is kind of like a purple brownie color this really is a gorgeous lipstick especially when you pair it with a um, like the correct lip liner uh, I think this lipstick is super gorgeous and I absolutely love wearing this color two left to go so the next lipstick I have is this one right here this is another Maybelline color sensational lipstick in their like nude collection and this is in the color 955 espresso espresso exposed there we go <laughs> that's hard to say and that's what this one looks like right here it is just a brown lipstick and I absolutely love this lipstick because I don't think it's like anything else I have in my collection and this was like my first brown lipstick that I ever bought and worn and everything like that and I just think it is a super color. It is unique but that's why I really like it and that's why I bought this lipstick to wear it and everything like that. <music> lipstick that I have is this one right here. This is from Revlon and this is in the color 477 Black Cherry. And I believe this is the darkest lipstick that I have, or it's pretty close to the last one that I showed you. This one is like a brown lipstick. It does come off a little bit um, like a red tone tint to it as well when you put it on your lips. Like, as you can see, it looks like totally brown in the tube, but once you put it on your lips, it turns into like a, like a really dark burgundy color. It's a super gorgeous color. Yeah, so that is just what this last lipstick looks like. That 
is it for my lipstick collection video. I hope this video wasn't too long for you guys, and I really hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And until my next video, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, everyone.